Hi everyone, welcome to GoFries and in this video we'll have a look at this XPG SX8200 Pro SSD. Now the one with me here is the 256 gigs model and it retails at 75 US. The packaging is simple, it comes with just a drive and a sticker for you to place on the drive itself. The SX8200 Pro uses 3D TLC with SLC caching and it is rated at 160 terabytes for TBW and has a mean time before failure of 2 million hours. Benchmarks checks out for all the tests with results within the margin of error, except for the IOPS reading for the 4K on AS SSD. The drive does get toasty if you transfer large files. In my test, I tried transferring 80 gigs of data into the drive, and in my transfer, I did two tests, one with a heatsink that is from my Astro X570M Pro 4 motherboard and another test without the heatsink. What happens is that both show fast performance at the start, then drops to a low few hundred megabytes per second after a few seconds, then almost immediately raises up to one gigs per second speed. And almost a minute later, it drops down to a 200, around the 260 megabytes per second transfer speed. Both showed the same behavior, but that is until a minute and a half into the transfer where the one without heatsink plummets in transfer speed to below 200 megabytes per second, resulting in a transfer time that's almost two minutes longer than the one that's with the heatsink. So this is clearly something to do with the thermals of which without the heatsink, it heats up and then the transfer speed will be slow. Overall, the SX8200 Pro from XPG is a solid product. Go back from me, and if you are looking for one with faster transfer rates, aim for something that's 512 gigs and above. Alright, so that's it for this video. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.